Since my workshop is in the basement of my house, I like to keep the sawdust to a minimum to avoid tracking it everywhere. One of the ways I do this is by regularly vacuuming the floor with my shop vac. This works pretty well, but I've been having wrist issues lately, and holding the vacuum hose really aggravates my wrist. To solve this problem, I'm going to make a more ergonomic handle that clamps onto the vacuum hose. I know there are commercial solutions for this that aren't that expensive, but if you've watched this channel for any length of time, you know that sometimes I just like to make the thing instead of buying it. I start by gluing up some leftover 2x4 material that I had previously planed smooth for another project. This will form the collars of the handle, which I'll expand on later. Next I try to figure out a more neutral wrist angle for the handle and measure that angle using a sliding bevel. I'll make the handle out of a piece of scrap 3 quarter inch plywood. I'm sort of freehanding the shape, using an axe handle as a template for the grip. A little bit of cleanup work with the file smooths out the curves. After the glue for the collar blanks is dried, time to figure out their shape. These will have a hole through the center to clamp around the hose, and then have flanges on the sides to accept through bolts. Since I don't have a hole saw the correct diameter, I'll use a fly cutter to get the perfect sized hole. Next, I cut a dado on the top for the handle to sit in. Once the handle is fitting nicely, I rip the collar in half down the glue line. The fit needs to be loosened out, so off camera I took a bit more off the collar with the table saw. Yeah. <laughs> 
To make it more comfortable to hold, I round over the corners with the router. The flanges on the collar need a counter bore for the washers, which I made easier with this setup. Trying to do this freehand would be practically impossible and very inaccurate. Then, with the setup kept the same as it was, I used a smaller bit to drill through for the shank of the bolt. With all the processing done, I sanded everything smooth and gave it a couple coats of water-based polyurethane. Since glue alone won't be secure enough, I'm using some machine screws with barrel nuts to clamp the handles to the collar. This is similar to the fastening system IKEA uses on their furniture. Threading into plywood, especially between the plies, will just cause the plywood to split. This way is much more secure, and I can always tighten it down later if it gets a bit loose. This might be a bit of overkill, but I also used some red thread locker to hopefully keep the machine screws from loosening. To help the grip of the collars, I'm adding some cork sheet to the inside diameter of the holes. Now it's time to attach the handle to the hose. I'm using nylock nuts here to keep them from loosening. With that done, time to test it out. I have to say, this is a lot better than holding it the way I used to, and it will hopefully save me some wear on my wrist. I'll use this for a while and see how I like it, and may end up changing the handle profile if I don't think it's comfortable enough. But for now, this will do nicely. Thanks for following along in this one. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.